Samsung is going to release Galaxy Z Fold 5 with some big changes and after getting those changes we might not see one feature on the Galaxy Z Fold 5 which was available on the Galaxy Z Fold 4. We all know by this time that Samsung is going to use a new hinge design on the Galaxy Z Fold 5 which is water drop and after getting this new hinge design we cannot stand anywhere as a free stop which means what you guys do with the Fold 4 cannot be done on the Galaxy Z Fold 5. The feature is particularly called flex mode which was available on last generation but getting a new and better hinge it's not coming and I have a list of new updates which are coming along with this new hinge design. First, the crease that we all are concerned about is going to get a treatment. As per Anthony, Samsung created the perfect balance between reducing the crease on Fold 5, which means we can hope to get a better looking crease, more like an Apple Find N2 and not like Fold 4. Second, the hinge is now more smooth while opening the device or even when it is fully open and you don't need to force the phone to fully open. Also, Samsung is maintaining some sort of flex mode. Although it will not come with a like Fold 4, but we'll see some sort of flex mode, as Z Fold 5 was already appeared online, which confirms the new software of Galaxy Z Fold 5. That is, One UI 5.1.1. This is the biggest update after the launch of Galaxy S23 Ultra, and with this new update, you're going to get update in stock apps and flex mode. So a new flex mode is coming to the Galaxy Z Fold 5. You all wanted a more durable foldable phone, and Samsung has achieved a durability goal on the Galaxy Z Fold 5. As I've already talked about this, Fold 5 is going to come with IP58 rating, which means some sort of dust resistance. Fold 5 is the first foldable phone to offer such feature. Due to a flat folder design of a new hinge, Fold 5 will going to come with water resistance but additionally, dust resistance along with it. Remember, it will not completely save your phone from dust. You need to listen to this. Galaxy Z Fold 5 will going to come with these main updates. The hinge, which is the most important part, the new and better displays. Some says we can get a wider cover display. No, it will not. Same as Fold 4, 6.2 inches cover display and a 7.6 inches inner display. The difference is the new technology, which will come with a more brighter display. And on cover display, we are going to get a Gorilla Glass Victus 2, which is much more durable compared to the Victus Plus used on Fold 4. Also, a new vibration motors and a speakers are coming. Don't expect a built-in S Pen, as initial rumors were indicating the built-in S Pen, but later, Samsung dropped the idea, due to a space limitation. But you can use S Pen on Fold 5 only on inner display, and to be very honest, we don't really need S Pen support for cover display, as it is too tall. Samsung changed the launch location of Galaxy Z Fold 5, which is going to happen in Seoul, South Korea, and the dates are confirmed. As it is going to happen in the last week of July, confirmed date is 27th of July, not 26th, which was rumored before. And phones will be available in the market between 7 to 11th of August, but you can pre-order the day it will launch. If you guys are concerned about the battery life of Galaxy Z45, then you should watch this video. And don't forget to subscribe, I will see you next time, till then, peace out.